Hi, I'm Lester Manley, the founder of Trailblazer and the inventor of the Pico. We're excited today to, for the first time ever, to do an unboxing of our brand new product, which we believe is a game changer and we're very excited as a team at the factory. First thing we do, open the box up, of course, uh, which is hopefully an exciting moment for you. Um, while you get ready to take this little game changer out, and this is the Pico. So, there's very little to do when you get the Pico or ideas so you can get using it as quick as you can. So a few things you need to do, I'm just gonna take you through it very quickly. First of all, you open it up like that. Remove your packaging. Inside, you have a few bags with some bits and pieces in it. So very quickly, I'll take you through them. This is a little scoop, and this scoop's used for basically moving your charcoal around or for, for cleaning it out at the end, which makes it very quick and very simple. And then you've got clip-on clip tool holders, which are really quite cool. It allows you to hang, to hang or suspend your tools, your burger flipper, onto the side of the machine, which means if you're on a beach or if you're in an environment that's not particularly clean, all you need to do is set this wherever you can and you can keep your tools off the ground, nice and safe. The other nice thing is that it's suspended off the table, which means there's no heat issue, there'll be no heat damage, and it'll work extremely well. Another thing you need to do is, this is removable, your lid's removable, and that gives you a lot of, a lot of control over, um, if your space is tight, just take it away, if it's not, use it as a storage unit. But the one thing you have to do is put the handle on. So take this out, underneath here, you'll find a little bag of tricks. And what you do is you just take the handle, just pour it out actually, get rid of that bag. So you have a handle with two little items called standoffs and you've got two nuts and two washers. So what you do initially, and then what you have is this a little tool holder, which is quite cool. That bolts on the inside and that allows you to put your tools inside that and that'll stretch nice and stormy. You can put your two burger flippers or a basin and brush or whatever. You put your screws in through the hole of the tool holder. Second one here. And then very simply thread these. These got little, little guides to keep them in the right place. And just present your first through, screw up into this nut and hand tighten it. Tighten it up until you can get it comfortably tight. And then what you get in the box with it is a little Allen key. So you just go in the inside, tighten it up. And once it's, once it's finger tight, just move your Allen key onto the short bit and give it another good, nice tight tighten up. And then you know that that handle is on really solidly. What you have with you are all the tools you need at any point in time which is the little multi-purpose tool here, your Allen key for removing your firebox if and when you need to. This spanner here is used for adjusting what's called the friction block. The friction block is a little block at the very bottom of the machine here, and that grips the winding rod to levels of tension to suit you. And if it comes a wee bit loose, all you do is you go onto each of them and give them the tiniest nip equally both ways, either loosening them or tightening them. And what that does, it just gives you ability to control the tightness of your wind-up mechanism. So if you think it's too tight, you can loosen it, so it goes up more freely. If you think it's too loose, you can tighten it. So that's it lowering up and down, that's nice and tight. And as you use that more and more, that could loosen slightly and just allows you a wee quick nip. Then what we do is we attach, reattach the lid like so, and line up those two pinholes, and on she goes. Once that's on, you can then put on your grill, and the grill simply clicks in here, making sure this bar is on the top, and that's it ready to go. Your height adjustment for your heat control is this winding mechanism, so that gives you ultimate heat control, always so that you never get too hot. And then what you have is this multi-purpose unit. This is a scraper for when you're finished and you want to clean. You know how hard it is to clean stainless steel. 
Well, this cleans the, the bulk of the dirt off, do it on both sides. Put it in a, in a sink or, a, or, or this tray here with hot water. Let it soak for half an hour or so, give it another scrape, a rub with wire wool, and you're gonna have it spotlessly clean. Then your tray, your lower tray, comes with, with a separate uh, shelf. So you've got this, which slides in. So you can, you can take the tool out to just use this purely for keeping stuff hot, or you can then put this into three different levels. When you wanna take lower stuff out, and you want to, so you can have stuff going in this tray, grilling and cooking, and you can have stuff down below. Uh, keeping warm. So all you do is literally, when you want to put stuff more off the grill, you do that, push that towards back, hinge that up, load that up with food, and then move it back down again, and continue to cook, grill, bacon, or whatever else you want. So that's the Pico, and that's it all put together. In another video, we're gonna show you how to light it properly, how to get the best out of charcoal. And then we're also gonna show you a little video, which is all the accessories and the other things you can add to the machine. And as we go, there'll be more of those. So it's a matter of packing this up, just setting everything in, nice and tidy. Dropping your grill bar down. Closing it over. And there's one missing, always a missing one. Closing it over. Lock it up. Attach your shoulder strap which comes in with, with the machine as well, as standard. Once you've attached your, your shoulder strap, that's a very, very easy piece of equipment to carry. So what you do is adjust it to your length, whatever length you, suits you. Put it over your shoulder, and that's us. So enjoy your pico. I'm away to have a barbecue.